Jai Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nityananda Shri Advaita Gadadhar Shri Vasadi Gaur Bhakta Vinda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Rama Hare Rama 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 Hare Hare So, I had the good fortune of being in Calcutta in Prabhupada's time, 1975-76, at that time, His Holiness Bhakti Raghava Swami was a brahmachari at that time in Mayapur, and he was serving. So, we knew each other a little bit. I was more in Calcutta, I was doing preaching there, life membership. Bhakti Raghava Maharaj, he was out here in Mayapur and he was doing Namhata preaching. The pioneering, the Namhata preaching. He was a real pioneer. He really sacrificed everything for going out there and preaching in the villages. You can see there's an early Back to Godhead mag magazine. Yeah. An, an article was written by Anaka Dumbabhi Prabhu. Hare Krishna. Uh, Naam Hatta Prachar Me Maharaj Ne Shuruvat Kiya Tha Back to Godhead Bhagavad Darshan Jo Patrika Hai Usme Ek, ek Article Ek Lake Bhi Chapa Tha Iske Baare Me So uh, Anakadambabhi Prabhu, he was a, he was a Pujari here, uh, he was from the UK and so he wrote an article anyway about Maharaj and it was called The Lame Can Cross Mountains. <laughs> so ek, uh, ke jo pujari tha, anek, uh, anek kadam pro? Anek? Anakadambabhi. <laughs> Anakadambabhi Prabhu the, wo yaha pujari the, unho ne ek uh, lake likha tha. कि एक जो बंगू है वो भी पर्वत को पार कर सकता है। So he was telling about how Maharaj was preaching in the villages there, despite his handicapness physically, but spiritually he was very strong and very determined। देख सकते हैं कि Maharaj कितने निश्चय करके थे कि कितने strong Maharaj कितने strong हैं। कि उनके शारीरिक उन्होंने जो शारीरिक जो उनकी सीमिताएं हैं उसके बावजूद भी महाराज जो हैं इतना बड़ा चीज चालू किए। So His Holiness Bhakti Raghava Swami Maharaj has been something of a, a visionary. In other words, he's been looking to the future and thinking about the future. परम पूज्य भक्ति राव महाराज जो हैं एक विजनरी हैं वो भविष्य को देख सकते हैं जो अभी नहीं है उसको भविष्य में भी देख सकत and it's something which we all need to do. We need to see the situation on the planet and how the world is becoming more and more, uh, how it's, everything is deteriorating so much. We all need to learn how to do it in the world, how to do it in the world. As you see, the world is growing every day and every day. Young people leave the villages. अपने घर को छोड़के गांव को छोड़के फैक्ट्री में जो है जाके काम करते हैं। And the result is there's no young people left in the villages anymore to grow rice, to plant the rice, and to cultivate the the fields and take care of the cows. नतीजा ये हुआ कि चावल उगाने के लिए गांव में कोई नहीं है, गाय को संभालने के लिए कोई नहीं है, गांव में सुनसान पड़ा हुआ है। Maharaj is thinking about how to provide for the people in the future. महाराज सोच रहे कि आगे की पीढ़ियों के लिए उनका खाना पीना उनका सब आगे का बंदबस कैसे होगा ये महाराज अभी से सोच रहे हैं। We used to be able to buy potatoes for one or two rupees. Now it's ten, fifteen rupees a kilo. पहले एक रुपए किलो आलू मिलता था अभी पंद्रह रुपए किलो मिल रहा है। And it's going to go up every day. और हर दिन ये बढ़ ही रहा है। The prices are not going down. They're all going up. कीमत घट थोड़ी रहा है, बढ़ ही रहा है। How will we ever be able to feed the people? 
दुनिया के लोगों को खाना कहाँ से मिलेगा कल But actually we have land, but we're not using it. हमारे पास जमीन है लेकिन हम उसको यूज नहीं कर रहे हैं। We're thinking only about sense 